What's up, guys? Welcome back to the show. I am your host, Dante, and we are back with another video. And it seems like every couple of months, the very popular manga slash anime, One Piece, finds itself triggering the masses, especially on social medias like Twitters, right? Or, sorry, X. And just like clockwork, it's happening again because according to Niche Gamer, One Piece animator attacked on social medias over a bad scene. What? Yeah, bad scene. <laughs> I kid you not. And I like this picture right here. Whoops. Can't show that in the Christian manga. <laughs> so here's what you guys need to know about the situation. Before I continue, make sure y'all do me a favor. Drop a like if you enjoyed the video. A comment to engage in conversation. Do your, your boy a favor. And subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I really appreciate that. Share this video and follow me on Twitter. Now with all that being said, let's get to work. Let's jump right into it. All right. So it says, an animator who worked on a recent episode of One Piece has been harassed by uh, X, formerly Twitter, user for their depiction of a character during a bath scene. The character in question is Yuri Bonnie. I hope I said that right. The captain of Bonnie Pirates. During a particular scene, Bonnie is uh, nearly naked as the characters all take a bath together. You know, because it would be very weird to be fully clothed in a bath, right? I mean, I'm gonna assume you'd be taking off some clothing, right? Yeah, anyway, and it's anime. <laughs> so, One Piece is not necessarily shy about having the women being, uh, you know, half naked or naked in a, in, a, in a bath, so this shouldn't really be an issue, but you would think not, right? And uh, so the reason this third controversy is that Bonnie has the powers of the Toshi Toshi no my um, age age fruit and while she normally takes on the appearance of a woman in her early 20s She's chronologically 12 the age age fruit allows Bonnie to not only alter her own age But also the age of others so she can literally age you up So in this picture that we're seeing it, you know that I showed you guys above she's Depicted as an adult. Okay, got it just checking. Uh, she used the power to make people experience near uh, unalive experiences or age herself into hypothetical futures where she's stronger. That's actually pretty dope. The artist known on Twitter as KDA was proud of their work on the show as seen below. This is KDA taking credit, you know, for the work they did. Said, participated as a key animator and hashtag One Piece 1090. I hope you enjoyed Bonnie's scenes. Whoops, Kenjo, then the Christian manga. <laughs> I freaking love it. Uh, so, what do you think about this? However, some social media users took the opportunity to try and attack the animator due to Bonnie's technical age, despite series uh, creator Ichiro Oda being responsible for Bonnie's design. Now, here are some of the comments attacking this animator that's listen you don't have to like it i, I get it <laughs> you don't have to like the uh situation at hand but you know threatening people harassing people over you know fictional characters they're not real you know they're it's anime that's a little excessive you don't have to like it i'm not saying you should go and just praise it to high heaven but you can you know, tell them how much you don't like it respectfully without trying to tell them to go unalive themselves. You feel me? So anyway, here's some comments. You should be, you should be beat with large rocks and a hammer. Ooh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Harsh. You're probably posting out. You're, you're probably posting out here as you did some sort of noble act. Effing creep. Praying the worst of the worst happens to you. Sheesh. Okay. Uh, this guy says found him. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, KDA appears to be laughing it off, especially since most anime fans are coming to his defense in his um, in the replies and quotes. It's, I mean, yeah. It's not real. I don't give a shit. You don't have, I'm saying you don't have to like it, but like trying to tell someone to go kick, you know, you know be hurt and be hit hammers and rocks is just insanity 
it's definitely insanity, right? And here's some of the ones I found on Twitter, thanks to Chibi Reviews. It says, Epstein's Disciple. Oh my God! Wow. They went there, bruv. They went there. And I think another one's right here. It says, when Oda goes to hell, you going deeper. Oh my God! Yikes. <laughs> yikes. Big yikes. Okay. It says, me reading comments and replies and laughing. Delete this gang. If they find us, it's over for you. KDA. Uh-huh. Yep. Another day of fake outrage against the drawings of a fictional character. Facts. People harassing this guy for simply doing his job gotta be the biggest loser the world has ever seen. Facts on facts on facts. He's an animator. He did not create the character, the character's backstory, or the abilities of the fruit that um, she ate, giving her those powers. He had a job to do, and he did it with pride. It is what it is. You, you're not going to fault him <laughs> for doing his job. He's an animator. Not the creator. The creator is the great Ichiro Oda. And if you got beef with the character, its powers, and whatever it may be, you got to take your beef to Ichiro Oda. And which we all know, he doesn't give a shite either. So, <laughs> you know, he'll, he don't give a shite. So, it'll, it don't matter. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> Excuse me. With all that being said, you could just be respectful with your disagreements with the character design. I mean, I'm just like I said, I'll say it again. You don't have to like it. But going overboard and threatening harm on people and harassing them and, you know, on the live and threats, it's just a sign of pure insanity. And you guys need to seek some serious mental help. But anyway, that is what's going on in the current One Piece controversy. Uh, well, my bad. Controversy. <laughs> Can't speak anymore. But what do y'all thought about the whole situation? Drop your comment down below in the comment section. If you want more content in nerdy geek culture, anime, manga, gaming, controversy topics, make sure you guys do me a favor and subscribe, hit the bell, and I'll see you guys in the comment section and in the next video. Later.